So in terms of installation, this is an easy once and done. So there are two terminals on this lid. The, there's the tracer wire terminal, which is your direct connect terminal, and then there is your ground switch terminal, and you install the wires on the underside of the lid. So we're going to do the tracer wire first. The first thing that you do is you strip about three-eighths of an inch of wire, or of insulation off of your wire, put a 90 degree bend on the tracer wire. This is your, uh, your dielectric silicone gel. You can either tear this open or, or rip it open. It's easy either way. We're going to cut it open. And then what I want you to do is um, put some dielectric gel on the conductor. There's a set screw on the direct connect post. We're going to back that out just enough to get the tracer wire in the tracer wire slot and then tighten up the set screw. Your tracer wire is now installed. We'll do the same thing for the ground wire. Strip off about three-eighths of an inch. Back the set screw out of the ground switch terminal just enough to get your ground wire in the lid. Coat the wire with the silicone. Tighten up the set screw and your tracer wire and your ground wire are installed. And then what I would do with the rest of the silicone is just liberally grease up the connection point of the jumper bar onto the ground switch terminal as well as the tracer wire terminal. That's that. And then you want to install it on the base. Now in the field, this is an at-grade access point, so the ground will come up to here, so the tracer wires will be coming up through the bottom of the base. Um, for the demonstration purposes, we just have two small sections of tracer wire and ground wire. So you install this on the base, take your pentagon wrench, loosen the pentagon bolt, which loosens the locking mechanism and allows you to put the lid on the base. Tighten up the pentagon net and it's installed. So after the installation you'd simply connect your positive lead of your locate transmitter to the direct connect tracer wire terminal and then you would either engage or disengage the ground depending on what you want to locate. It's that simple.